Hey guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you what's in my backpack, grad school edition. So I'm going to start with a big pocket before I get into what's inside. This backpack is from Hirsch. Herschel, I don't know how to say it, but I bought it on Amazon and I absolutely love it. It's like the perfect size um, It really only has two pockets. It has one outside pocket and then this big pocket, but that's really all I need I really just wanted something simple. So If you guys want the link I can link it down below um, They have one in a diff bunch of different colors, but I just got a simple black one because I feel like colors um, I just get over colors really quickly slash they get dirty but now to get started with what's in my backpack, we're going to open up the big pocket. And all right, so first we have my computer. So I always have my computer in this um, marble case. And I got this case on Amazon as well. If you guys are interested, I can link it in the description below. So I usually just have my computer. And I have a computer case from Amazon as well. Then I have these folders, which if you look at my school supplies shopping video, you guys can see that I got one for each class. They always come in handy when I have like handouts and stuff. And then sometimes I have my textbooks for my classes because in a few of my classes we refer to the textbooks during class. So it's always nice to have those handy. And then getting to like smaller stuff. I always have this notebook where I keep my weekly assignments slash readings that are due for that week. So for example, like this is week one and I color code all my classes and I just know like what color is for what class and I usually just highlight um, what the readings are and then if there's any assignments. So I have that for each week so far. And I'm going into my fifth week which I actually have not been there yet. but. So I always keep that with me because if I'm unsure about assignment or someone says, oh, like, do you know when this is due, I can just refer to my weekly planner, I guess. It's not really a planner, but... And then I have my notebooks that I got here, I'm written notes at all. Um, I used to take in red notes in undergrad, but I found that in grad school it's a lot more efficient to do everything on my computer as just like a personal preference, but in case I ever do want like paper I have some so here are my notebooks and then of course I have my planner I keep it with me always in case a professor tells us in class that they're changing a due date um, it's nice to just look at and if I ever am in between classes and want to add some stuff to it then I have these three pencil cases okay so why three I like to separate my highlighters, which are in this one. I have, like all my highlighters in there. And then in this one, I have all my felt pens and just like some regular pens that I use to color code my classes in my um, planner and as well as I just need pens for class forever doing like an activity or something. And then the blue one is for pencils, which I used to use pencils a lot, like in undergrad, and um, I recently switched over to pens, and I have not used one pencil yet. I feel like it's always nice to have a pencil for some reason, but I have a bunch of mechanical pencils, so. And I have to keep them separate because I feel like it's better than having one giant like pencil case where like everything is in one and you just like can't find anything so those are my three pencil cases and then last but not least i have this cute little i guess it's like a wallet type thing and i keep some essentials in here so i have some poop pur puree the before you go toilet spray because you never know when you're gonna need it of course a mask because always need one of those handy and I always tell myself oh I'm not gonna forget one and it's nice because I don't even think about it but like I know that I always have one in here in case I do forget one I have some chopstick I have 
some hand sanitizer. I have some band-aids in this cute little case that like my school gave me. I don't even know how to open this, but yeah, band-aids. A scrunchie. And and then I have some money in here because our school has vending machines and sometimes when I'm there for so long it's nice to get a little snack or like a drink. Um, or if I forget to pack myself a lunch, it's nice to know that like I have some cash to go get me some lunch. So we're just gonna put all it all of it back in there. I guess it's my little emergency bag in case I ever need any of this stuff. So okay now for the small pocket. So in my small pocket I have let's see I have a mask another one. I mean you can never go wrong with not having enough masks. But then I have my blue light glasses which you can see my <laughs> camera screen in them but And I always have a charger because sometimes when I have long days and my phone is dying, it's always nice to have a charger with you or if a friend asks if anyone has a charger. I always I have my AirPods. I don't always keep my AirPods in my backpack, but usually in the beginning of the week, I always keep them in there in case I go to like a coffee shop or something or if I'm just doing work on campus. I have sunglasses because sometimes when I'm well, this was more for undergrad and I don't really need these anymore in my backpack, but always I feel like it's a forced habit you know? I'm just so used to having a pair of sunglasses when I used to walk to classes and if it was like sunny I used to just keep a pair of sunglasses in there, but um haven't really used them yet so. And then I have this little thing with sticky notes. It has like the little tab ones for like bookmarks And then if you turn the page it has each color um, This is super nice if I want to like make a note in one of my books or in my planner so they always come handy and then I have oh this is my connector for my computer to a USB because I only have the charging port and then like a headphone jack port and then last but not least I have my student ID which I need to scan into my school every day and that's basically all that's in my backpack if you guys want to see the inside of the backpack it's literally just pattern of stripes and it's just like big like a huge pocket um i honestly kind of wish there was a smaller pocket in the big pocket but overall this backpack is really great i love how it's like medium sized slash smaller this concludes my what's in my backpack and i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss a video and i'll see you guys next time